I suppose what a lot of people will ultimately remember you for, and uh, I suppose it transpired to probably your lowest point as a fan, uh, the game against Crystal Palace, which ultimately cost you a job as the pitch side announcer. Yeah. Can you just talk, talk us through the day? It's one of those silly things that happen sometimes. Um, I'd actually had thoughts of uh, stopping doing the job anyway that season, um, because as I say, there was a few things going on around and about. Um, I think it got blown out of all proportion what actually happened on that on that night. Yes, I did do a couple of the things that I was that people said I did within the club. Um, but I, the biggest thing that what got to me was the way that the stuff that was happening outside the ground was um, was mentioned as one of the reasons that I had to go. On the night, yes, I think it was fair that Peter had to make a decision because the Palace uh, board had made a complaint about me calling them what I called them. We all know what I called them. Um, at the end of the day, Phil, I apologise for what I've been done, but by the time I got an opportunity to apologise, the club had already announced on the website that I'd been sacked, and I had no idea that I had been sacked at that time, which was very disappointing. The club did have a phone number, at least one phone number, they could have contacted me. They chose not to for whatever reason, uh, or claimed that they couldn't get hold of me. Um, that wasn't like the police coming to get me again, by the way, that siren just going by. Um, I made a, probably made an error in what I did. Uh, I don't think it was that big a heinous crime. I should possibly have only been given pulled over calls for it, maybe, and given a warning. We've heard worse aimed at us at away grounds, and Palace included, where we were. We had the announcement about there's a caravan with a Charlton sticker in the car park, was one that they came out with while we were over there. Bit of humour. Maybe it was a bit of humour one step too far. I don't know, the club decided at the end of the day that it was.